Mini or the Classic, whichever you prefer to call it, the Hakachi 2. I don't know if I'm fucking saying that right still, but it doesn't matter. Uh, had a new version released the other day, which is now version 2.11, and the best part about it, there is no game limit now, and that includes the cover art. Um, there's a lot of features within it. Uh, I have a download link to this, uh, the version 2.11 in the description. If you have any questions about it, just let me know and I'll answer that. I'll probably do a video of the tool itself, but it pretty much looks the same. The only difference is, is uh, now you can do the box cover art all at the same time with a single Google search. The only bad thing is if you already have the cover art for some games, it's going to go back over that game. And that could be time consuming, but it's no biggie. You could still do like the Google for the single game or the uh, browser, like the covers you might have downloaded. But anyway, it's just cover art. Uh, you can now select, have a console select, so you can either turn your NES Mini, keep it an NES Mini, or you can turn to a Famicom Mini with full Japanese. The fonts are spot on. I would do it, but I can't speak Japanese, so I'm not even going to bother it. <laughs> uh, button combination for the reset is still the same, but they added an auto. You can enable auto fire, and I think that button sequence is select plus A and B within the game. Uh, player 2 can now have a start, which is up plus A and B. It might be up plus select an A and B. Uh, I'll leave these combinations down in the description, but if you have questions, just ask me down in the uh, comments. Uh, and, uh, it's pretty much all the major stuff I can think of, but let me jump into this. Now, all this looks the same. But here's where it gets interesting. Now, you can put them in the folders, the, uh, each folder can have up to 90, but they suggest just doing 30 to 35 games within the folders. And I think they, this is how they get away with having no limit. Because if I'm just doing 30 per folder, so it's loading up. Let me just click one. Oh, I, before I click one, as you can see, it says Bionic Commando through Donkey Kong Jr. Math. It's alphabetized. So, like all these games are in alphabetical order, it does it for all the folders. So, here's how they get away with it. Boom. When you click a folder, it resets the system just like it's loading the original 30. So, I think that's how they're getting away with it. Don't hold me to that, but that's the only thing I can think of how he's actually accomplishing getting some having no limits to it with these folders having them load up like that so just put 30 35 don't get too crazy i mean you can have as many folders as you want <laughs> and uh oh shit i lost my train of thought but yeah this is it so uh load them up um it still does it where you load a rom but it'll ask you if you want to patch it there has been some mapping um, fixes, like I think it's 86 and 206. There's a couple more mappers that they added. I can't remember all of them. I think it's just like four mappers. Uh, some other minor fixes, stuff like that. So, and I haven't had a problem. The only game I've had a problem with, and it's a game, Gun Nap. The text on that game is still fucked up, so I hope they fix that soon. I don't think anybody's brought to his attention. I might jump on there and do that. But yeah, that so far that's the only game I had a problem with. Like the uh, Battle Toads uh, level two was all fucked up. It, it's working perfect now. Uh, Snow Brothers is working fine. I had somebody ask me about this. And just to show y'all the games are working fine, let me just jump into this. I mean, 
Like, we are, we is good. And I die. And then I'm gonna select down. Boom, back to the home screen. Then you have to touch the console. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, now if you would like to see the interface of it, or if you have questions about the tool, uh, you can ask me down in the comments, or you can shoot me a message over on my Facebook page, Sir Fits You Gaming. Or if you prefer Tumblr, I have a link to my uh, gaming blog down there, and you can message that. Um, but yeah, if you want me to test out any other games on here, uh, I'll make a video of it. Just leave the title and you know, what's wrong with it down in the description. I'll see what I can pull up about it. And let you know as soon as possible but uh yeah if you haven't already subscribe to the channel I will be doing frequent updates as you can see I try to keep y'all up to date as much as possible with uh especially with the NES classic because I know I'm staying on it like I'm Google and searching this all the time and a lot of the videos on YouTube with like some of the updates they're like from another country <laughs> and I can't speak other languages so I had to figure it out <laughs> but yeah anyway so I'm not just rambling on uh yeah uh I'm gonna just end it like comment and subscribe thank y'all for watching and I will catch y'all in